Did you reach Cosmo? That explains why we ain't been able to reach Cosmo. If you don't answer it, they'll vaporize us. I will handle this communication. All yours, buddy. Hey, old traveler. Have you accepted the truth of a divine promise? We have. My deceased wife and daughter are with me. Thank the matriarch for her gift. May the promise be fulfilled. You are clear to land on the spaceport. All them bars, and betting parlors. And noodle joints. Maybe it's not as bad as it looks? I assume it will be worse. Raker rallies regiments, while we wait whistling in the wings. Landing as fast as I can, Gold. What the flark? Great, Cocoon Boy thinks he's a butterfly now. He is a man of action. Let's just hope that he can keep the church busy while we look for Nikki. Didn't think you'd be able to bluff your way through security muscles. I am quite adept at deception. We're gonna need more than that to get to the Continuum Cortex and rescue Nikki. Especially with Golden Boy jumping ship. Should we, like, try to find him? Time is running out. We cannot lose focus if we are to save the girl. Drax is right. Let's just hope Warlock can do a bit of damage on his side. So, final showdown against Raker. This time, you'll get him for good. I intend to. We're not leaving here without Nikki. I am Groot. Groot wants you to know he'll do all he can to save your kid. You know what? I think I kind of understood that. Your kid sure got herself in a deep quill. Her mom died, man. If Warlock's telling the truth, that thing inside her is using Corel's death to manipulate her. I get it. Ain't gonna be easy getting her out of there, but I'll die trying. Ready, Drax? I am. My blades are as sharp as the rodent's tongue. Was that a metaphor? It was a simile. <laughs> you take care of the Milano, okay? Make sure the ship's still here when we come back. Let's do this! Time to save Nikki! Peter? Okay. Just be cool. Let me handle these guys. Travelers, have you come to witness the fulfillment? The what now? The realization of the Matriarch's promise. The beginning of a new world. One without death, or pain, or fear. You should know this. Weren't you vetted and clear to land here? What? Of course we were. How are you not aware of the fulfillment? Something is wrong. These heretics must be stopped! Attack! Oh! 
Yeah. No fair! He's boosting everyone but us! We must eliminate their medicinal conduit! Make your maker! Light him up, Rocket! better pray their new world comes without death or pain or fear cuz I'm gonna kill him for flarking up this spaceport they have been very busy redecorating all the more reason for us to get to the cortex and find Nikki Scott Cosmos towers shut down that's because it's never been dark before you do realize some of the guys shooting at us were nowhere security this does not bode well for the dog Never was the Mutt's biggest fan, but we could have used the backup telepath. Just because the tower shut down doesn't mean Cosmo is too. Last time we were here, he knocked out me, Gamora, and Drax, and Lady Hellbender's bounty hunters, like it was nothing. We just gotta have faith he's okay. Really, Peter? Faith? There does appear to be an excess of report here. Kinda dreading what we're gonna see in the marketplace. The same thing we saw when we flew in. Yeah, but it'll be up close. Nowhere really stunk sometimes, but... Clark! Over there! But so many of them! I thought most nobodies would have rejected the promise. Everyone wants something they can't have. Yeah, but these crooks were suspicious of anyone giving them anything for free. You're right, Rocket. The people who lived here were rough. I once saw someone beat someone else to a pulp because they gave them a compliment. No way they'd willingly join up. A sword to the throat can be very convincing. They got Flark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like on Hal's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the Continuum Cortex. To siphon Faith from multiple worlds at once? Is that even possible? The energy ain't filling these batteries. It's moving away from them. So they're powering something. Sure looks like it. I'm surprised the church was able to seize the Cortex. It seemed pretty secure last time. Eh, wasn't half as secure as the dog thought. The church's forces increased by the tick. Their superior numbers could have easily breached the defenses. Well, we got just the five of us. Let's keep it down. They don't know we're here.
Lousy fun flocker! Get ready to die! They do not fear death. Don't mean to get hurt at first! Rocket! Newcomb! We've alerted the converted! Terrible! Don't think your boss is gonna be too happy with you! We can't count on Cosmo, Peter! More batteries the deeper we go. 100 units says they're tied to the fulfillment. The priest said that they were bringing... They can't raise the dead, especially after we save Nikki. I had a contact here. Oh, 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 no, no. You did? Was it Blurt? No, no, no. Should up on foots, maybe? What? He always gave Groot the creeps. I don't suppose we could try tricking them again? Make them believe we're all promised stuff? Not unless you can fake that purple glow they all seem to have. Over here! Looks like we can squeeze through. We must be close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? Not really. There's a lot of debris in the way. There's no way through this wall. Hey, Whoa! Peter! Well, that didn't work. Clark, I'm going in. What about the fanatics? I'll toast them if I see them. We're the only ones who can do this, right? Clear back here, Quill. Looks like you're gonna have to yank a chunk free from this side, though. Gamora. You should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Let's hope it holds. Oh, Scott! Not Mantlos. <sighs> Look at her. This is personal, Quill. Peter, let's go! I know how much you love this dive. It was the one spot in this whole Flarkin galaxy where a guy could feel safe. I mean, except for the bar brawls and the security raids and the bounty hunters. We'll drink to it later. Right now, we've got to keep moving. I've been thinking about what Warlock said. There has been no sign of Goldie Braun since he left from our ship. Adam Warlock. Might be splattered somewhere across the lower city. Or got picked up by a wandering creep squad. Or maybe he was lying about which side he was on. He was just waiting to attack us. The Warlock carries an old grudge. Not align himself with the Grand Unifier. Yeah, what do we need the Golden Boy for anyways? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Magus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. My memory is flawless. I'm just an optimist. Ha! You know why we need Warlock to stop Magus' space magic ritual? We don't know space magic! Yeah, because that ain't a real thing. Nah, I'm Sweet not so sure anymore, point. not after Lamentis. None of this makes any sense, but Mantis gave us somebody who can fight it. Somebody who all's careful. More turkeys dropping in! They'll be dropping like flies soon enough! <laughs> Another promise destroyed! Don't mourn them, but lead them! This looks like a dead end. For some more than others. Why do you cry, Rodent? I'm not crying. I'm just remembering all the jobs I did here. <clears throat> 
They must have started the fulfillment already. Why? I just figured there'd be more converted around it. Rockets talked about these. He's gonna love this. Whoa. The Emporium used to be right here. Did the church destroy it? Doubt it. The Collector probably blasted out of here at the first sign of trouble. Before the first sign. The Collector's supposed to be able to see the future. Wait, how did he move the whole Emporium? It was a ship. Well, never would have guessed it from the inside. Maybe it's more of a shuttle. Ah, uh, Groot's right. We're getting distracted. The destruction is pretty massive. Looks like the church is trying to keep us out of there. That's not gonna work. There is still no sign of the warlock. Based on when he jumped, he's probably already in the lower city. In a busted heap. Improbable. He magically shaved when our backs were turned. Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. You're thinking it's the full Flarkman, ain't you? But it could just be runoff from the cables. Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Nah, the Cortex could... Nikki had Warlock's Soul Stone in her hand. What if it's fused there and Raker's trying to remove it? <laughs> like you did with Goldilocks? Didn't work all that well the first time. The girl may have sensed the evil in the stone and insisted they try again. Or she's outlived her usefulness and Raker wants the stone's power for himself. Regardless, we must reach the Undercity to find the girl and stop whatever they are doing. And we'll have to be ready for them to try and stop us. The converted ones will be prepared to die in order to bring their loved ones back to life. Which is pretty ironic, if you think about it. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We've become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. Ain't we just one big, happy Flarkin family? She's not garbage. Behold the power of her might! Via Magnati! Oh, 
Good. Gamora, wait! Hold on a sec! Why? So more children can be sacrificed in the name of Rager's flogged up church? No, of course not. Just... Just what, Peter? I don't know. Breathe. Every minute we waste. We don't have time to breathe. I know Rager brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos! It's about Nikki. And what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his protecting hand. By me. You killed your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's Promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. The nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can't. How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually... I kind of enjoyed being on, all things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have... What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted... She loves us. <sighs> I did not. You did. You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I can take. We accept you, Gamora Zenwubri. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. What say we go stop a nut job cult leader? Yes. Man, 
that giant robot can take a lot of pain! We need to focus on taking it down! This comes out of short to got a warlock's attention! Maybe he's already saved, Nikki! Who else did you kill? Anyone I know? We will require a comprehensive kill list one day! That big robot is a serious problem! He can't get us all! Come on, guys! Let's mob the bot! How do they have this many goons? To the Cortex? Who knows how many reserve forces they can bring in? Here. We gotta shut it down! Let's get to the bridge. Cosmos Tower is the quickest way. We should be prepared in case the Grand Unifier arrives. I'm more than ready. Drax, I have been eager to topple something over. You know, I usually hated when that Cosmo spotlight would shine down on me. But now I kind of miss it. I did not know you were so sentimental. Almost drowning changes a guy. Really? A Fate Force field? If we can find the power source, we should be able to turn it off. Let's get looking then. You see that kid in the ritual thing? I could not miss him. You think the church did that to his head? Or was the poor sucker born like that? You gotta disconnect the power, Quill. That's it, Peter. Let's go. We need to get out of here before Raker shows up. All right, get ahead! Let's book it! Now is not the time for literature! But <laughs> Guardians of the galaxy. The Matriarch has chosen to enact the fulfillment from this station. And you shall not stop her. She hasn't chosen anything! You've been manipulating her from the start! She is the light! And I... I'm merely her servant. Kinda hard to be the light with that dark monster thingy inside of her. Blasphemy! You may have rejected her promise, but you will believe when it returns you from death's cold clutches. Pain has pushed you to a perilous precipice, old friend. How? It can't be. I saw you die. The form is fleeting, but the foundation remains forever. Now cease this stubborn senselessness, before it reaps a ruinous reward. Ruinous? Oops.
Making short work of these cultist creeps! in our sleep. Thanos used to time me in fights like this just to make it interesting. They are no match for these blades, Peter Quill. All right, all right, listen. This isn't our first rodeo, guys. Problem is, if we play it cocky, one little mistake is gonna bring us down. So let's get back out there, give this fight complete dedication, and make them scream! Who's with me? Who talks field? This must is gonna wait. Fun. You said. Look out! I am good. Aggression is often the best protection. <laughs> These renegades are relentless! Prepare yourself! These shall not fail! Stay away from the edges! I gotta get close to get over! Okay! We gotta get to that elevator! Too bad they busted up the bridge! Full of them stronger! We approach the dog's tower! Then we're almost halfway there! Crap! Now it's Nova! These soldiers are deadlier than the local security! On his face, it was all like, Oh, my gilded glutes! Regal rear, his perfect posterior, his champion. Look out! Oh, my God, do you first? Let's not add to our problems. Well, I guess Goldie survived that jump. A warlock is more valuable than Too close! Oh, justice! Ugh. 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 These 
These renegades are relentless! Go one of the whacked out space cops! What you want? I was on the It's like all of nowhere showed up! As long as they're here, they can't go through with the whatever they called it! The full parkment! That was not the name! I like it better! Oh, we approach the dog's tower! Hold on, Nikki! We're coming! Blow him up! You rocket. <laughs> Running and grabbing on the rooftop. This is kind of fun. We will need tattoos to commemorate this moment. Of course, it was easier to get to before. What's next, Peter? <laughs> To pieces! Stay away from the edges! I'll lay down some cover fire to get you across! I am Groot! Well, you're a big target, that's why! Crap! Now it's Nova! Finally! I think they're giving up! Just in time, because we're not getting back on that bridge. I know where we are. There's a road nearby that intersects the main bridge to Cosmos. Where? It should be, uh, right below us. Warlock better not kill Raker before I get to him. I am eager to pull that sorcerer's insides to the outside. We need to be on the other side of this thing. We're not getting over. Would under suffice? Drax, buddy, let's make a hole. That's one way down. The best way. <clears throat> Guy seems to be winning. Always knew nowhere would get raided, but not like this. Thought it would be the world mine cracking down on him. They do have Nova Corps converts in their forces. You weren't completely wrong. Cosmo, he must have bribed so many people to keep this place fun. Anyone see a way across? <laughs> yeah, we can't do nothing with that sign in the way, Quill. Sure are destroying a lot of advertising today. Like we need another reminder to buy Calex cream. This carnage brings back troubling memories of worlds I destroyed. Always wondered, what did you use to do that? You gonna make us a bridge or what? Well, you gotta be fucking kidding me. I don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. <sighs> Throw me. What? Throw me! Just get muscles to huck me across. 
Do you have any idea how far down it is if you miss? We ain't got time to argue. I'll make it. Leave this to me! Valued member of this team. A tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual. And what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it? Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. No. We won't have to worry about that. I know I can get through to Nikki. This is Raker's doing, not hers. I won't give up on her either. Nor will I. Yeah, and neither will the Grand Unicorn. He will regret it. Perhaps we should summon the ship to deliver us to our destination. Ain't no way they'd let us land anywhere near the big party. Better off fighting our way there. Indeed. I would much rather face them with my blades. Structurally sound. Something tells me it never was. Yep, that's part of nowhere's charm. How dumb are these Flartnards to even fall for this full Flarkment garbage? Magus demands adulation, trapping you with vile illusion while feeding on your soul. I felt it in my promise too. That endless hunger. Oh yeah. Hungry is an understatement. Holy faith! All that light isn't leading to the Cortex. It is the Cortex. How could that mutt let this happen? Looks like you'll get to ask him yourself. This isn't going to end well. Cosmo! We've got to get down there! Don't count him out just yet. I've seen him get out of worse straits. Get away from me! This is being exposed to the No! Let me these belligerents do not stand a chance! You gotta keep them off, Cosmo! Let's worry about keeping them off of us first! Slash them, Gamora! Keep the breathing room, Groot! Lock and low, Rocket! Put your lights out! The is barely denting this thing! Why does the dog not mind blast them? I don't think he's in there no more. Hold on down, crew. Peter, Drax needs help. Show him some muscle. This is an historic battle, the last stand of nowhere. Something tells me we got more scraps to hand. Cosmo! Talk to us here! Why does the dog not mind blast them? I don't think 
What the fuck are you doing? He's one of them now. He's our friend. Yeah, so was Drax. And I ain't going inside this Fleabag's head. Maybe he doesn't have to come to that. Hey, buddy. Are you, uh... <laughs> Take him out. Before it's too late. Wait! He's still in there. I can hear him. I hear only barking. Focus your mind. He's there. Uh, oh, fuck it. Just shoot the mutt. No! <sighs> Easy, bud. Friends, remember? He's Peter Quinn. Cosmo knows never lie. lie. Yeah, buddy. It's me. It's all of us. Where is Cosmo smell? The smell of nowhere. Where else would we be, fur brain? His mind is addled. Or he is simply a dog. He doesn't see us. He's still in the promise. Cosmo, where are you? What do you see? Blue sky and cars to chase. Cosmo is big. Duma, how you see? Home. He's talking about Earth. Smell of fresh grass. Feeling of dirt between paws. No psychic burden, just walkies for going. And the ball for fetching. If you missed your home planet, could you not simply return at any time? Not at time that matter. Same reason Katarthian. Not go home. Earth was great. Cats to chase, trees to be on. But the point is, I get it. We all get homesick. But you gotta bury that bone and move on. Pyotr Quill does not know what he ask. He's like fleas, biting and biting, no matter how much Cosmo ah. scratch. Oh, you Terrans have a real thing for your home planet. What's one hunk of rock over another? It's not about rock. It's about what Cosmo had on rock. Foot of bed for sleeping, belly for rubbing, collar with name. You miss being someone's property? Cosmo not property. Belong to family. Then one day, family gone. Men in suits sent Cosmo into space. Cosmo searched many dog years for those he lost. But yet. You had owners. It sounds like they gave you up. What about your puppies, Cosmo? They're your family. Cosmo Young are... They're here, man. And they're counting on you. For love. For protection. But humans call for Cosmo to heal. 
must be loyal. Those pups actually need you. Be loyal to them. Don't abandon them in space the way you were. Cosmo would never. But you have. They're somewhere here on nowhere, maybe needing your help right now. Come on, Cosmo, you gotta know this doesn't smell right. Piotr Quill is right. Cosmo human have no smell. They are wicked perversions. You must bite them with all your might. Be gone! Cosmo not fit your lies. That's it, buddy. You tell them! Nowhere is Cosmo home be. His pups, his family, will protect at all costs! Sick him, boy! <sighs> Should we help him? I mean, we may need him. I am optimistic for the beast's recovery. Cosmo's got his mission. We've got ours. Let's get to the Cortex. You think he'll be okay? He's got a thick coat. All right, I still got access codes from when me and Groot were on vacation. You mean when you quit the team? Why do you always gotta be so... Flark! Quit attacking scratch snatchers. Gah! Cosmo changed the codes. I guess so. All right, people. Let's find another way through. Perhaps you entered the code incorrectly. I have made the same mistake. With those sausage fingers? Of course you have. These nimble digits don't make mistakes. Drax, how do you keep from breaking your hands smashing through everything? Catathian bone density. But you don't even have cuts on your knuckles. Roots right. This is a really old mining settlement. Everything was nice and crumbly even before the church shot everything to hell. I know it's slow going. Blame the Flarknards who wrecked everything. Do you know any shortcuts? In case you ain't noticed, the entire geometricals of this place have been flarked. Come on, let's do some demolishing. I support the small one's plan. 